Hi guys, welcome to Workout with Dai and today I'm going to be reviewing this Euphoria yoga mat. Okay, so this is the mat coming straight out of the box. So as you can see, minimal packaging which is really nice, thank you Amazon. And that's the mat. So with the mat you get this strap that you can carry the mat with. So I'm just going to test that out here. So the strap is attached with two elastic ends. The elastic ends just fit over the rolled edges of the mat. And then you just carry it like a bag. It's a pretty cool feature that you get the carry strap with the mat. So thank you for that euphoria. So first impressions, I love the color. Um, I chose the blue and it really is the kind of blue that I like. It's a teal blue, which I don't know whether it comes off well on the camera. I love the little sewn emblem. So there's an embroidered tag. It's kind of very similar style looking mat to um, the Manduka or the Jade. Um, you get a carry strap with the mat and that just pops over the ends and it's elasticated on the ends so that you can then put it over your shoulder and carry it. So I just wanted to mention as well that most yoga mats when you get them have a smell and this one really isn't that bad. Um, it's not overpowering. There is a slight smell to it, but it's really not that bad compared to some others that I've had that have been pretty bad and I couldn't use them for like a whole week. So this one straight out of the packet, it's really not that chemical or plasticky smelling. It's pretty good. So this is me doing yoga by the poolside. This is a concrete floor here and the six millimeter mat really did provide some nice cushioning so I didn't really feel it here on my knee when I was um, pushing down through the floor I didn't feel anything underneath the mat so there was any no little pieces of grit or anything I didn't feel them um, it was a really nice cushioning when I was down on the floor with my face lower to the floor didn't smell any real strong chemical smells coming from the mat. There is a very, very slight smell, but if you know yoga mats, this one is by far one of the best that I've had for smelling. So that's a definite bonus that it doesn't really have that new mat smell. The one thing I would say is that the grip wasn't perfect. Um, it was good. But I did feel um, that in Downward Facing Dog, my hands did slip a little bit on the mat. So if that's supposed to get better the more that you use it. So I felt like the cushioning was really nice on the mat, was really nice on the joints. But it was also good that when I did some balance postures, it wasn't too cushioned that I couldn't find my balance and I couldn't ground through my feet. So all in all, I definitely did like this mat. It was a good, solid yoga mat, great for yoga, Pilates, or any kind of floor work for your home gym.